Try Mount Street. They cannot think yet. If they could, they would still pick up their weapons. Three fifty six PM Overcast Main District of Trimounts. This is the third time you've paged through Telopsis' personal log, Doctor. Any new discoveries? Hmm. Elena's coffee ought to be pretty good. I'm more interested in the Agri <laughs> I can't pronounce Agripnotic Frank's been using personally. I love a drink after work, as much as the next, but all that fluid intake on the job is bound to cut up your train of thought. From the logs to Lopsis kept keep synchronized with us, we can tell that along with her, there's our other Rhodes Island partnered operator, Elena and Ryan Lab's energy section. Along with Ryan Lab original uh, art section's director, Dorothy Franks. That's everyone caught up in this abduction by the pioneers. And practically simultaneously, Saria informed us Ryan Lab Ecological Section's director, Mulesis, went missing after she sent out an SOS. There's no telling if she's currently dead or al alive or dead. Man, who puts alive or dead? <laughs> uh, I think there's an issue at Ryan Lab. At present, looks like it. Sky high odds, Ryan Lab is already in crisis. If things are pushing Saria to ask Rhodes Island for help. Lucky the land ship's nearby, or else we'd be hard-pressed to make any expeditious response. The kidnapping's gone down at the new site around a hundred or so clicks out from Trimounts. But Kelsey's concerned this has something to do with the experiments that got shut down a while back. Original Mutation Experimentation Kelsey's cleared us to access all the relevant files before we enter the Trimounts. The Diabolic Crisis, Loken Water Tank, the Lumber Yard. Each name means something to one of our Rhodes Island operators. Behind their fronts, ties to a hundreds of similar experiments. Most of these experiments have involved Originum's mutative effects on living, living being cells, and each one has incredibly been incredibly dangerous. In Colombia, more often than not, tech giants like Ryan Lab aren't going to participate directly in such high-risk experiments. Though a smaller scale organizations carry them out on their behalf, hire a pioneer team, construct a suitable site out in the wasteland's fringes of the city to execute their experimental work. In this case, Telopsis is at Site 359, which is one of those. Have you done work at similar sites before? Work? I'm not gracing my time there with the word work. Those megacorps plagiarized what I created and applied it all in place it wasn't meant to be. See that billboard? About 50 meters out? Vorvort Kuchensky's automatic popcorn tron for the home. Faster, sweeter, every time. I still have the prototype sketch for its energy core on my terminal. It was supposed to be used in an automatic wasteland road cleaners at first, but my manager decided to never sell as a product. He says, what kind of HR companies spending on better equipment for pioneers? Brought my mind to Rhodes Island after that. Our course clear team in engineering's using the very latest model. I've long seen it coming, be it Volvort, Kuchinski, or Ryden Lab. In the end, all these so-called tech firms are going to be destroyed by their own creations. Because they've never respected the creations themselves. It's not some horrific test subject holding Telopsis hostage, right? Was that a laugh line, Doctor? Because what you said isn't sci-fi flick material. Or a dumb joke. Chances are it's tomorrow's news. Man... No wonder you and Logos make a good team. As a partner, Logos is pretty good. But can you give him a reminder, Doctor? If he could cut some of his speech craft, mission times would go down by at least 30%. And 
and I could spend more time on my actual job. Done processing the intel, doctor. This is as much useful information as we have for now. I've already set the most important files to top priority on lookup. You can read them via PRTS at any time. Any more news? Delops' logs haven't been updated past this point. Device number 9's data transmission should be more stable ever since Mayor adjusted it. So unless something physically happened to Delopsis. Fingers crossed Silence and Gray find their ASAP. Silence will notify us of any developments at the site as they happen. Sorry, has copied the info. She'll be rendezvousing with us in an hour. Doctor? Any other pro proposals for the time we have left? Go to where Mulesis hit trouble. Take a look. I'm a ma mechanist. I'm no detective's assistant. And I'm just an original researcher. You're, only, you're the only one I can count on. All right, doctor. In that case, we move now. Here's hope and I'm back on the landship by tomorrow. At my beloved workbench. Six forty seven PM Overcast Test Site three five nine Observation Station Trimouts Outskirts Anything new with the people on site? Nothing, officer. You shot word to your director Clooney or whatever at Ryan, right? When exactly will he be here? Doctor Clooney's in a meeting right now. Meeting? You're telling me he's still in a meeting? What kind of meaning is more important than his employees' lives? Damn it! Give me those binoculars. Uh, okay. You don't think those pioneers are going to follow through, do you? Let me tell you. They will. Push them enough, and they'll do any freaking thing. See, Mina colleagues at, colleagues at the site could be in mortal danger. Who are you? Olivia Silence. Ryan Lab Researcher and Rhodes Island Pharmaceuticals Partnered Medic Operator. This is my colleague from Rhodes Island, Mr. Gray, with the Engineering Department. Hello, I'm, I'm a Rhodes Island Electrical Engineer, but I'm, I'm still interning. Rhodes Island? What kind of useless crap does that company do? Err, uh, forget it. Save the explanation. One day passes in trimouts and a barge of fresh companies names unloads out of the sewers you're Ryan lab right got any pool in the office pool ma'am I'm not too sure what you mean forget it I knew you wouldn't be in charge you strike me as one of those eggheads swimming in the books types like the hostages they've got you guys and those guys might as well live on different planets I heard they were the pioneers Working at this site. Pioneers. The name ring is too nice for anything except billboards. And I know better than anyone what kind of people they are. Convicts. Gamblers. Infected who can't stick the medical fees. Nothing to lose by the time they went out to the waste. Uh, excuse me. C could we try and talk to them? He might have realized already, but Dr. Silence and I are both infected. We're in a place to understand the situation. Ryan Lab makes stupid cash, doesn't it? So does Rose Island or whatever? You've got these. Let's say, well-intentioned. Company's paying your insurance premiums. That's the key thing. That's why you can shut up about understanding them. Premiums? Which part exactly is... It's the way things work here in Columbia. A policy aimed at infected. Ma'am, please trust us. Rhodes Island is a pharmaceutical corporation dedicated to addressing infected issues. Addressing issues? If I gave you a crossbow and told you to square away those kidnappers from here, would you do it? I couldn't. I'm a doctor. What about him? Me? N no. I don't think we've ever reached the point where we have to resort to violence. Then it looks to me you two can't be much help at all. Why well, ain't she 
just a bundle of joy. <laughs> no sign of anyone coming, sir. They're playing it cool. Say, you think the Mega Quartz might not uh, care if their hires die? Well, with those two being infected and all. Don't give me that. Infected aren't subhuman or nothing. At the very least, we don't want to treat each other like that. All right. Set that on the Pioneer Recruitment ads, too. Well, kind of like your stars, the ads ain't all eyes, then. Would you kindly drop the communicator, Dr. Urbica? He said drop it. No fun in business. All right. It's just still right there. I'm, I'm putting it down. Please don't hurt us. Sir, she was sending messages. Bring me those comms, Sam. Hmm, only half type. Didn't get to send anything yet. These are our exact coordinates. You want them to send a drone in or something? Let me give you another idea. Change this to an SOS. Send it to your tutor, your manager, whoever. Tell them, I'm waiting and my patience is running out. What exactly are you after? Well, that's wicked simple, Doctor. Me and my friends here. We all just want to leave this place alive. That's all. Well, you didn't have to kidnap them. That just raised your chances of not getting out of here. What? I don't understand. Director, finally you're back. In spare moment. You're Ben. Ben from Structural. You remember my name? Call me Ferdinand. Nine old directors at Ryan Lab and all. Sir Ferdinand. My next meeting is in 10 minutes. I can spare you seven of those. Uh, all, all right. Thank you. Thank you. Sir, do you know where Control is right now? I've got Structural's application for equipment purchases here. Control was supposed to give us an, an answer three days ago, but we haven't heard anything from her. Structural's having to suspend a lot of ex ex experiments right now. Give me the form. All right. Go procure. D did... Did you just sign? The handbook says large-scale equipment purchases like this expensive have to go to control. How long have you been in Miss Ryan Lab? Just a couple of months? Yes, sir. I reported in a month ago. See this site in front of you? Huh? Isn't this... Isn't it monumental? 15 years ago, this place was still wasteland. Not even a single nomadic plate yet. You wouldn't see Ryan Lab on a fold out of tryouts back in those days. I meet Parvis for tea. If you get the chance. You've got a lot to learn, Ben. And you won't find it in your handbook. Uh, all right. Got it, sir. Well, look at that. I still have four minutes left. Not often you call me when it's light out, Ferdinand. Bro, what the heck is this? Whole Hayak? What? what? <laughs> Are you done with everything I asked? Mm-hmm. At least three empty seats for Lion Labs. Director's meeting today? No. That's not enough. Oh? Which director's next? Are you finally fed up with the old goat behind the chimeric organism experiments? Or do you want the dreamer at the test site to never come back? Where does Rhodes Island's people want went to the site? The experiment's almost complete. I don't want anyone getting in the way before it's done. Understood? You want me on site? No. No need for that. How cruel. Your assistant's one of the hostages, isn't she? I saw that Elena girl weren't once. She's as pretty as she is hardworking. I had a feeling you'd like her. She's with energy. She can wrangle the pioneers. 
You keep an eye on developments in the city. It's unlikely Rose Island would only send two operators to the site. Don't forget, Sari has had a line to them all this time. Oh? Your defense director again? Sari has already stalled our experiments long enough. Both the colonel and I are running short of patience. Remember, they can't find anything this time. He's up to no good. It's the place, Doctor. Last message we got from Saria was sent from this alley. Mm, we aren't exactly near Rhine Lab HQ. Here today is about a half hour trip by car. Seems like Mule Sis got chased here. If she wasn't being pursued, she'd never choose to set foot in this alley. No matter who it was, acting in the open streets would have obviously been too risky. Silence told me about Mule Sis's ability. Right. Search complete. Ability to manipulate water molecules. Would that be energy conservation type or a matter restructuring type in terms of original arts? No matter which principle it is, it's powerful at a glance. Water molecules. No flaws visible to the naked eye. Even more interesting. Experimental research folks and us mechanics. Um, mechanists are alike. Our powers of observation are usually razor keen. If fooled even silence and mayor, then it's not your ordinary art solution. Um, Milsus has self, strong self-preservation abilities. There's a couple of scorch marks on the ground. Not very wide range. Whoever did it, all signs point to some kind of tech technical equipment used to heat the air surrounding Mulesis. Considering arts are heavily dependent on water molecules, her opponent must have known her well. As well as we do. You mean, they might be a Rhine insider too. Doctor, watch out! Well, that ain't very nice. I was almost well done there. That was an energy weapon. Shot from deep inside the alley. Enemies only 30 meters from us, give or take. I'm getting closer. Doctor, you want to stay behind me. Defense systems active. Can we hold out? Bruh. Dr. Rain, I've never seen this model of power armor before. It's new. Without testing, I can't tell you exactly how destructive any weapon hooked up to this could get. And by that, I mean, we need, we need a change of plans. Escape systems active. Now get on my back. We're getting attacked by mechas. <laughs> okay. I can't believe it. That signal interference acti active in everything. Even Closure's own latest drone gen can't detect our location. What sensory tech is this power armor using? Can you paralyze it? I don't want to draw attention. Hold on tight, Doctor. 10% power. Aim. Bingo. Bro, I don't know if that worked. Oh, it's still moving. Clear damage to the right arm. Plating detected. No reduction in speed. Showed no signs of slowing when hit either. Who's in that suit? Did he not feel pain? Honestly, just blast his legs off. Damage to the left arm. Damage to the lower right leg. Doctor, it's not reacting to the damage at all. If you want to stop it, I'll need to paralyze its power core in one shot. Come on. This makes no sense. 
Even the most well-trained soldier wouldn't have this much tolerance. You're right. By mere fact of living, no individual can wholly suppress their most basic nervous response. She's gonna punch it. <laughs> Based. <laughs> A hand smashes through the power core, armor's core. Countless mechanical fragments burst out like fireworks, just as the blood of a fellow life form would. With no time to waste, that hand pulls out. The mech fragment extracted by her sheer force turns into dust, together with the pure white plating covering her five digits. It all drifts down to the floor, where it forms a paper-thin calcium crystal layer. The power armor lies on the ground, the heat of its energy snuffed, a clean hole left through its torso. You pierced the power armor's core barehanded? That's a might of mites, definitely acquired in my defensive cannon. Doctor, looks like the Bureau of, uh, Originum whatever won't be taking us in for attempted bombing today. I do not want new criminal records for Rhodes Island. Thanks for that, Saria. No need, Doctor. Mechanist. I'm the one getting Rhodes Island involved in Ryan's internal affairs. I have a duty to ensure you don't come to any harm. Ferdinand was right on the money. Rose Island's people have already found, Saria. Should we maintain our pursuit, ma'am? If I stuffed you inside that power armor just now, do you think you'd survive? Relax. Just a hypothetical. Ma'am, no matter how powerful Saria is, there's only three of them. We've got them way outnumbered, and outgunned with our secret weapon. Underestimate the enemy at your own peril. Have you, haven't you been around Rhodes' Rhine lab enough to learn? The punier scientist looks, the harder she might just pulverize you. You mean that mechanist or the professor-looking one with the hidden face? They can't be stronger than Rhine's defense director, right? Rhodes Island, they've got talent for days. Let's go. I'm in love with that hypothetical just now, and I've got... And I've got a few new ideas I want to try out. She's not safe. Good evening, Colonel. Clooney. Give me a rundown of what's going on at the site. Just a minor boat rocking. You know how hard it is for pioneers to be satisfied. No matter how generous you get with their terms. Initiative is their strongest point, and it forms the basis of Columbia's endless expansion. But sometimes, it carries with it a little... hassle. So it's hassle. Unhassle it, then. I want to see the results you promised, not Ryan Lab in the gossip rags. Remember, you aren't the only tech company in Columbia. Understood. Rest assured, Colonel. Ryan Lab's products will not let you down. Sir, got a whole crew w wanting out of this now. They say your plan's hopeless, and nobody's going to listen to us. We can try everything we want. We'll never get our voices out. They're also asking who cares what Ry Ryan Lab's up to. Like, we just need to get this work done sooner. Get our money, move on to the next place, and keep going. As for the guys who went missing, well, their luck just ran out. The pioneer teams out in the deep waste see a lot more dead every year than we do. Anyway, I get it. Tell them to just hold on a little longer. I'll bring our people back. So what's your plan? I'm going to head out for a bit. Out isn't 
Isn't that too dangerous? Cops sent sharpshooters. They might just be waiting for you to come out. Sounds like a good deal to me. What? You're keeping your head together, right? A police sharpshooter, right? Might just be an old friend of mine. Crack shot was a crossbow. If it's how it's gotta be, it's not gonna hurt too bad. Sonny. Talk to Urbica. Doc Moore. I need you to come out for a walk. You can drop the pretense. We have a choice here. Brain not. Keep your chin up. Once the folks outside get to see the score, maybe they'll change their minds. Open up to taking our demands seriously. Well, unless you're like going to show you're willing to kill, I don't think they're going to take you that seriously, right? Officer, we got movement. Drones, prepare to fire. No, hold your fire. Officer, we can't hurt the hostages. You, uh, Dr. Silence, over here. Is there a development, ma'am? Take a look through the binoculars. Are those, two your co are those your two colleagues behind the, the Pioneer? Sir, the, the calm lit up. Give it. You would be you? I could say the same thing. You, uh, you made rank, right? Didn't get a chance to congratulate you. Who need stay at that precinct so long? You keep getting all this hassle from the frontier. And I never thought you'd end up so... depraved. You still remember any of the classes you took? Your law courses? You still remember the shit you said to me the day I joined the force? That's great. We'll be partners again. It'll be just like all those games we played, yes, kids. We'll protect Columbia's peace. Bring the bad guys to justice. <laughs> How's that irony? You're bad guy number one right here now. Mary. What's all that crap your boys are holding? Homemade weapons? Drop those things before you embarrass yourselves anymore. You degraded yourself this far. But you still have an option. One final option. Let those two innocent ladies next to you go. No. That's not in the cards for now. Damn it. You're inching over a cliff here. Sure, the government lets a criminal join the pioneers if he doesn't want to do hard time. But if... You break the law again in the, out in the frontier, we're charged to step by you. Answer me, counsel. Don't call me that, Mary. I'm begging you. You're trying to guilt trip me. Yeah, I feel guilty now. Guilty I let you go when you broke into my house. I should have hauled your ass straight to the station. That was a long time ago. I mean, I'd only just... I'm sorry. I've always been sorry about that. But this time, I, I have a reason for doing all this. You have to hear me out, please. Sir. What? Doc. Doc, she, uh... Doc Moore. Configuration. Error. Entering. Power save mode. Oh, shoot. Joyce. What's happening to her, doctor? You can tell. She's having an attack. What? Is it oripathy? Come on, I got her. There's drugs for her, right? I, I can't do injections. Come on, she looks like hell. I got this first aid treatment band Ryan gave us. This does something for oripathy flare-ups, right? I'll put it on her. You're willing to give your own emergency care device to Joyce? If you hand her that band... Your odds of survival go down significantly on the off chance you get a sudden attack. The dog's been good to us all this time. 
I don't want anything happening to her. You say us the ones who kidnap me and Joyce. We never wanted to do you dirty. I'm sorry. We're just a bunch of selfish nobodies. Damn. Are the comms still going? Ma'am, would you mind giving me permission to talk to the pioneers? The Liberi experiencing an attack is my colleague and my good friend. And more important still, I am her attending physician. I want to gather her situation from the pioneers. Judging by their reactions, they clearly aren't unconcerned for her. Go nuts. But you don't have much time. I just got orders from up on high. If the pioneers refuse to cooperate for another 10 minutes, we'll cut all comms to the test site. Along with all the power to their living quarters. You'll cut the electricity? Day-night temperature swings are massive in the Barrens. They'll be freezing by midnight. And there's several late-stage Euripacy patients among the pi pioneers. They need medical facilities to live. I know. That's what makes this a warning. They need to know how serious Ryan and the police are here. All their protests and demands have to be founded on a legal basis. Once they take the criminal route, nobody's going to hear them out. But aren't you friends with that pioneer leader? Friends? The moment he abandoned himself, there was nothing left to say. How is she? Real-time blood crystal density is dropping. Eye movement and in dices are still highly irregular. Eye movement and dices. Due to her repathy's focus lying in the brain, any fluctuation in her condition will impact her nervous system, cause her to fall into deep sleep, and go so far as to trigger epilept epileptic attacks. Huh? Who's there? The comms are still open. Hello, sir. I'm Joyce Moore's attending physician. My name is Silence. Doc Silence. Firstly, I'd like to offer you my thanks. Joyce's condition has only stabilized so quickly with your aid. And that of the other pioneers. You're gonna thank us kidnappers, huh? In return, and please trust me when I say this, we really, truly wish to assist you. We still have five minutes before your comms and your power to your living quarters are simultaneously cut. Sir, we've got a blackout. It seems they've acted ahead of schedule. Don't sweat it. I gotta appreciate you willing to be being willing to warn us. I gathered from the ma'am Mary that you, you'd like a dialogue with Ryan's, Ryan Lab's upper management. Can I ask why that is? I want to beg them to stop the experiments they're doing here. To what? You're a good doc. Same as Doc Moore here. But something tells me stopping a project this big is out of your hands. Can you tell the Ryan Lab boss that this experiment is seriously wicked dangerous? Sir, do you have any proof? Even if I did, would you believe me? A lone pioneer at the end of his rope. Officer, we're all set. We can cut the site's comms at any time. Wait for Doc Silence to finish. But the director's demanding immediate... Sorry. What poli police rank does your director hold? Remind me. Tell freaking Ferdinand that saving people is my job. I'm not taking him on a ride-along here. The director's been in contact with the commissioner officer. They drew up this plan together. Director, Ferdinand, I never imagined the fence would fall under energy's purview. Er, if Ferdinand feels that structural is his rule, is is his to rule too, then I would not mind resigning from Ryan Lab, effective immediately. Joyce, Joyce. Is she asleep? She's lost consciousness. 
If we don't get her treatment in time, she should experience brain death before long. Sir, I am preparing to enter the site now. I understand your concerns, so I would like to reassure you I will not be carrying any weapons. Don't do anything stupid, doctor. I know full well what I'm doing. Sir, I will not allow any police officers nor defense personnel to follow me. Researcher silence. I will report your conduct to the director. Director Parvis. I am entering test site 359 under my status as a Rhodes Island operator. Me too. And my electrical engineering colleague will accompany me. We will provide medical services free of charge to Ripithy patients on site. Not just for my friend, but for all of you. I do not care what choices Ryan Lab makes in the wake of this. I only know that this. Treating the infected is constant to the Rhodes Island Code of Conduct. Hell yeah, silence. You fucking show them. 